children that we don't subject them to our lack of maturity or sensitivity or understanding. All of the above. Maybe it's for the best. You know what they say about breaking up. It's like falling in love all over again. We have to be careful not to be fooled. Yes, we do. <laughs> by our emotion. By what we had. We'll never lose that. What we once had. Our feelings, you, you can't count on them. No. No, they, they change. They die in them. Yes. Oh, yes. So I guess we agree on something. This is it. We split up. If these terms are satisfactory... You're very generous. I didn't want money to be a deciding factor. Just tell me that you know that I wouldn't have stayed married to you for the money. Yes, I know that. You know, if I'm going to stay married, I sure as hell am going to stay married to someone I love. And someone who loves me. You didn't sign it. Free woman. This is a fantasy brought on by stress. You see, I'm very upset about, about Liza's divorce and it's affected by brain. Okay, darling, so you just pinch me. Go on, please, I beg you. Just pinch me and I'll wake up and I'll be fine. Well, I could pinch you till you're black and blue, but you would still be Stuart Chandler's love bunny. I don't believe you. I mean, Stuart would have said something. Well, rumor has it that his mouth was otherwise engaged. But Stuart's a gentleman. He's honest. I mean, Liza told me that Stuart never tells a lie. I mean, to go to, to bed with somebody? Aren't people supposed to tell the truth to each other? Oh, yeah, and did you bother to tell him that you had a private detective lurking in the hallway waiting to record his every passion? And whose side are you on anyway, Obo? I'm just trying to get you to face the facts, honey. You spent the night with Stuart Chandler, and you got the photos to prove it. No, 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 that is impossible. Look, darling, I told you what that man was like. Mm-hmm. He was ravenous. He was passionate. And gentle and sensitive. He was an artist. Remember I told you that he was an artist? I mean, I was swept away by his strength, his desire. I mean, no man has ever given himself to me so completely. I mean, he held nothing back. Well, honey, you said yourself that Stuart could never tell a lie, and he swears it was him in that bed. Oh, excuse me. I... It's just me, Stuart. I can't do this by myself. Your attorney is in the corridor. But I assure you this is a legally binding document. That's not what I meant. Do you want me to sign this? I want you to do whatever you think best. Your attorneys will be happy. You never get terms like this in an open court. 
Samuel, get in here. We both signed it. Why am I not happy to hear that? Liza, is this what you want? It's her signature. That's not what I asked. And these terms. Yeah, take it to the judge. We wasted enough time already. I'm not doing anything until I get an answer from my client. Liza, is this what you want? It's, it's not just what I want. It's what's possible. There, you see. I'm sorry. Yeah, me too. May be consoled by the fact that these terms are unbelievably, even insanely favorable. Samuel. Okay, Belinda, if there's nothing else, let's go see the judge. Let's get this over with. You can do better than that. Think. Really think about your fingers squeezing around my hand. Come on. Think about when you used to hold my hand. You know, back when we would go to the movies and you would squeeze my hand during the scary parts. And you'd come home at night and you'd hold me all night long. Don't you want to hold me like that again, Mateo? Come on now, baby. Try for me, sweetheart. Please. Squeeze my hand. Oh. Do that again, Mindeo, and I'll believe it. Just one more time, baby. One more time, squeeze my hand. You did it. You hurt me. Oh. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. I'll be outside. Catch you later. Mary, I hope you're not too angry with me. We, we were both so mixed up that night. You thought I was Adam. Well, uh, you two look so much alike. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and I was so sleepy. And when you kissed me, and, and it felt so nice. And, and if you'd said Adam, but you didn't. And I thought you wanted me. <laughs> So it wasn't till, till the next morning when you, when you called me, Adam, that, that I figured out what happened. Well, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry. I, I never meant to hurt you, Stuart. I, oh, no, no, no. That's, it, that, it's okay. That didn't matter. It doesn't make any difference. I don't understand. Well, no, no, no matter who you thought I was and, and, or, or who, why I thought you were there, it doesn't change what happened. It was a lovely time. You were so sweet and, and sexy. And you made me feel so good. Well, I, and I, I hope you feel I hope you feel good real soon. And if you thought you had a chance, why you signed this agreement? Because it takes two people, Ellen. 
It takes two people to work on a marriage. And Adam gave up. Did you tell the judge everything was okay? In a matter of speaking, Stuart. We're divorcing. Why? You love each other. Liza said she didn't want a divorce. Then why did she sign that agreement just now? I gave her every chance to back out. She... Nobody forced her to sign it. Did you tell her you didn't want a divorce? No, no, you didn't, did you? You, you were testing her, weren't you? Yes, maybe I was. Don't you think I have a right to know if I'm being made a fool of after everything she's put me through? If it was a test, she failed it. No, Adam, you failed. You lost everything. Liza, I'm telling you, his face was so hopeful when I told him how you went after David. I mean, he wanted you back. It was obvious. The whole time, I'm trying to convince him to give us a second chance. He's drafting a divorce agreement. It was obvious. He wanted out. You're a good liar, Adam. Maybe she signed the paper because she thought you didn't want her anymore. That woman has more tenacity than I'm. If she wanted me, she would have thrown that paper back in my face. It's over. Then you know what? Maybe it's for the best. So this is it? It's over? It's for the best, Stuart. Judges accepted your petition. So we're divorced. Yes. We can either wait on the paperwork or pick it up tomorrow, Liza. No. Let's go. I'll call you tomorrow. Yes. Hope you're happy, Adam. You got what you wanted. Tonight, we honor Liza Colby and her sizzling performance.